Kennedy to kick off for the purpose. Kennedy to kick off for the purpose. Purple kick goes into the end zone for automatic touchback. First and ten Wildcats from their own 20 yard line. Thank you. 
across the nine yard line. Wildcats can get a first down inside the ten. And again, once again to Fred Bell. Bell just down to about the seven yard line. Where it'll be third down and three for the Wildcats.
And I really like the low part of the low green leaf there. Gain of three on the play, second and seven for the Wildcats. Second and seven, three yard pickup for T. Second down, he's at 33, the Wildcats. No bail!
second and ten now for the 20. Nick Richard to Colton comes to the near side, runs behind Meyer and Johnson. Has to fight hard to get some yardage. Colton, three yard gain up to the 23 yard line, brings up third down and seven for the purpose. Wow. 
Johnson. They threw a lot of bodies. Second down and eight. Mm -hmm. and, uh, from the 43. Mm -hmm. And this time they faked the Johnson. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Harpo gets outside of left end, driven out of bounds on about the 30 yard line, but there is a flag on the play. Well, got a nice block to spring him for the first down, and it was off to the races. He was uh, face mask. Face mask against the wild hand. That's why you get the face mask. He was kind of drug out of bounds. So we're even seated on the face mask. So the purple's in business now. The ball is going to be marked. 15 yard penalty moves the ball down to the 16 yard line where it's first and 10 for Bowling Green. Harpo gets inside the 15, gain of one on the play, breaks up second down and nine for the purple. Second and nine, one yard pick up for Harpo, the ball is up 15 for the Wildcats. Police want to do John Napier. In motion is Hart Wiesman on a keeper is stopped with no gain. There is a flag on the play. Illegal motion against the purple. The preliminary signal. The illegal motion is, is declined, brings up third down and nine for the purple.
Bell gets up to about the 14 yard line. Should be good enough for a wildcat first down. Bell gets up to about the 20 yard line, but there is a flag on the play. Where the flag comes from is a holder. Holding against the Wildcats is a preliminary signal. Ball is moved back to the 10 yard line where it'll be first down at 15. up to about the 47-yard line, a gain of one on the play. Danny Ferris, 
The second down and five for the Wildcats. Correction, third down and five for the Wildcats. Flags are thrown to that old team for Spencer's family. 
Holding against the pedal, against the wild cast is a preliminary signal. Ten yard penalty from the point of the foul moves. First down and twenty six for the Wildcats. Spencer downs the ball back at the 32 yard line. Time out, purple. Spencer downs the ball on the 30-yard line. As your first half comes to an end, with your score of Franklin Simpson 10, Bowling Green 0. Harpoo returns the Wildcat kick up to the 24-yard line, where it'll be first and 10 for the purple. As Harpoo gets outside of right end and gets up across the 30 yard line, but there is a flag on the play. Blocking below the knees against the purple. Where it's first down and 22. <laughs> Colton gets out across the 20 to the 21 yard line where it'll be second down and 13. up to the 
the six yard line. Let's see what the call is. Let's Over see. the shoulder now. Special team way back from the face mask back. against the Wildcats, a preliminary signal. And a big face mask on that cast on to the Wildcats. That's their second. That will be a first half. Very similar to the opening drive of the game. 15-yard penalty moves the ball up to the 41-yard line where it's first and 10 for the Purples. Yeah. 
youngster. No signal. He's close. Second and goal for the Purples from the Wildcat two yard line. Colton going over left guard goes in for the purple touchdown.
Green Salmon. First and 10 for the purpose from the Wildcat 19-yard line. 
convert to the football. Dante is still down. He's trying to train. The faceless timeout. yard line. The second down and three in the purple. Two minute mark, two minutes to go in the third quarter. 17 to 7. Franklin on top of the purple. Johnson gets down inside the 10 to about the seven yard line. Good enough for a purple first down. First to go for the purples from the Wildcat seven yard line. <laughs> Wiesman on the keeper is dropped as he gets to the five yard line. The second and goal.
gets up across the 30-yard line, but there's a flag on the play. Holding against the Wildcats is a preliminary signal. What now? <laughs> oh, you hate to see this almost. Because every time he's been backed up, he's come through big, getting the full back out of the backfield or able to hit the second. Last time he hit Bowen, 79 yards to play with. They cut down on a 13 well off their own 21. So now they're going to have to run the ball is going to be ball is moved back to the 19 yard line Backfield in motion against the Wildcats is declined. The first and ten to Purples from their Wildcat 23 yard line.
Wade on the reception for the purple.
McGee getting us outside of left end gets down to about the 49-yard line, a gain of one on the play. Brings up third down and 11 for the Wildcats. Thank you. 
Carpo. They, they must have given. Harpo getting over right tackle gets up to about the 11 yard line. Timeout. Timeout for measurement. Harpo with a good second effort. Try to get that first. You know, we were just talking about Henderson County and Tom Bell possibly making that run to four eight title. And I mean they are the short. Fourth down for the purple.